Hello and welcome to my Lego Atlantis building a shark tutorial. Uh, right now we are going to be focusing on the main body, so uh, watch carefully at the pieces you will need. You will need three hanger pieces, one grabber piece, two one side rounded two by two edge pieces, a one by two red piece, a two by two red piece, a curved two by two top rounded piece, another piece similar but in reverse so it's on the inside, a four by two dark gray piece, you will need these shark grabbers for the fins, but a flag colored gray or dark black would work just as well. And then last but not least, the famous dorsal fin piece. I know a lot of you will not have this piece, so come up with your own idea. Here's one that I found. Now let's start this build. Alright, so first you're going to need this piece, remember that? And then after, you are going to need this piece and this piece. So you need the 2x2 two two red piece, the weird fancy feet piece that's flipped inside out like this, so it kind of looks like a boat, and then the hanger piece. Now what you're going to do is you're basically going to take your hanger piece and put it on the front like so and then you are going to take the red piece and stick it on the back all right now you're gonna have to take this piece and obviously another one of it these rounded edge pieces that are two by twos now what you're gonna do with these is you're going to take them on the red piece you're just gonna stick them on with this other one, I'm gonna take it and stick it on. Now, in my opinion, these don't matter. They don't have to be rounded, I don't really think. But, you know, see what you come up with. All right, now that we've got that down, you are going to need this piece, and you are going to need, you will also need this piece of the two sides and it's a two by two. Now, what you're gonna do with these is you're gonna take this thing, you're gonna attach that up to the front, like so. And then after you have both of these pieces, forgot to mention that, you need two. Now come over here and you are going to attach them to the sides, like so. You're going to need this piece and this piece. Now what you're going to do with this is you're going to go and you're going to take it and put it right there. Now with this piece, you're going to take it and you're just going to put it right on the top. Just like that. So there you go. Now you're going to need your two uh, sort of wing pieces, these two things, but you know, a flag could work, even if it was white, it would work, you could make it a great white. Um, they don't need to be curved like this to work. So you're just going to take them, and this is the body, so you know, the head's going to go right here, so you're going to want to place them on if they're curved like mine I would recommend placing them on like this see so the heads right there you know smooth movements and so you're going to want to stick it on if you have the curved piece. If you have the flag, you don't really have to worry. Stick it on like that. Whoops. Stick it on like that. 
so it's a shark fin. Do the same with the other. So the curved part is facing towards the head. All right, there you go. <coughs> now you're going to need this grabber piece and your one by two red piece. So what you're gonna do with the red piece is you're gonna go ahead and, well, first you might wanna do this, but you stick it right there and then stick that right on top. Sorry if that was a bit confusing. Heads right there, two fins, so it's right there. Now to finish off the body, you're just gonna need this piece. The one that is, uh, can be connected on the outside, but not on the inside. So like the reversed one of that. And then you're going to need your dorsal fin. And like I said, you can just use a piece and then stick a little, I don't know, like a flag or something on top to make it. Does not need to look like this. Um. So what you're going to basically do is take this, so take it, this is where the front of the head is going to be, take it, and you just press it on, there you go, then you take your dorsal fin, and you just stick that right on, and there you go. You finish the body. Moving on now to the head. What we're going to be building here is just the eye, the teeth, and the mouth. You do not need teeth like this, but you do need the mouth drop ones like this. So let's get started. You're going to need two one by two red pieces. Two just one dot, uh, one by one transparent red pieces. They don't need to be transparent, but it looks cooler. Two grabber pieces or hooker pieces, whatever you want to call them. All right, this is the latch piece, and this is the placement piece. They fit together to make a movable joint. Um, some of you may definitely not have this. So experiment around, see what you can do, and if all else fails, just make a still jaw. You will need four teeth. No, you don't need teeth, but they look cooler. And you can use substitutes for teeth if they have that little dot on the end. But other than that, you're gonna need those. Then you're going to need these two uh, half triangular pieces fitted together, they create kind of a sticking out square, so almost like a half pyramid. Uh, yeah, you're gonna need two of those, dark gray or black or whatever. Alright, you're gonna need two of these polished off thin ones with this little latch on the back so they can hook on to stuff. Two of them. You're going to need a full bar hanger one by two piece. Then you're gonna need another previous piece just like the one before, except it's a bit smaller. Just a you little know, bit. I don't think there's really a difference actually, but you know, it should look a little something like that. And that is what you will need to build the head. All right, you're gonna start off with uh, this piece, and then you're gonna need your full bar hanger piece, and you're going to need one of your one by two red pieces. Now what you're gonna do with those is you're gonna, you know, take this. So take your red and this. Stick the red on right there on that kind of outward piece so it is higher but still attached. Um, then take this full bar hanger piece, 
and attach it to the edge like so. The red one should still be slightly higher. If not, then you may have a wrong piece. Uh, now it's time for your sort of a latch piece, a holder piece, and then you're gonna need your like two of these red pieces, transparent red pieces. And then you're also going to need, and following that you're gonna need this uh, one by four gray piece. What you're gonna do, oh, sorry, I forgot to include this over there in the items thing that you'll need. Sorry about that, but anyways. So take your two transparent red pieces and attach them, one on this side, one on this side. Take your sort of chair latch holder thingy and then place it right there. So it'll fit. Hold on. So, yeah, so make sure everything's adjusted and that it fits. Right. After you got that latch put on, you're gonna need your grabber piece or you know kind of hold on piece. Now most of you will want to put it on like that. You're gonna need to put it on like that. Now put that on. Let kind of lift it up and stick on the gray piece right there. So it's sort of like that. All right, then after you do that, you're gonna wanna go ahead and take your red piece, take your two half pyramid pieces, and then you're gonna wanna go ahead and take two of those uh, grabber pieces. Now what you're gonna wanna do from here is take your red piece and you're gonna wanna place it up on top. Oops. And then you're gonna wanna go ahead and take this, stick it on the side. And then you're gonna take this, stick it on the side so it should look like that, almost like a staircase. And you're gonna wanna take that, and that, and then go ahead and take these two pieces, then you're going to want to go ahead and see how it's like the staircase. So you put them on like that, and then you put this one on like that. Whoa, that spazzed out. So it looks like that. And the, the, this is the top jaw, by the way. There's his eye. Um, so yeah, that's how you would open the jaw. See, it doesn't look too bad without teeth. But, you know, let's get started on the teeth. You're gonna wanna take your four teeth. And you're gonna wanna attach one to this edge, make sure they're facing inward if they're this type of teeth that you have. Also, stick them right there, right there, and then another one on that side. I'll speed up the process for you. Alright, there you go. Make sure that this piece, if it falls off, stick it back on. Um, Make sure all your teeth are put in very tightly so they don't fall out. As you can see, it took me a while to get these in. I don't even think the front ones are in all the way, but I think they're personally, you know, pretty much as good as they'll get if I don't want blisters on my fingers. So there you go. He opens his mouth and, well, that's what you get. Now, moving on to the last and easiest part, the tail. The items you will need for this are 
these two kind of hanger pieces with like the tops exaggerated and they're a one by two. And coming on down, you're gonna need three uh, grabber pieces that are one by twos. You're gonna need another one of these it, with the little thing on the back that lets you latch on to stuff, except this one should only be three wide, approximately. So not as long as the others. Then you're gonna come on down here and you're gonna need three of these kind of half triangle pieces. Put together, they kind of make a, period, a pyramid. So you see, you're gonna need three of those. Now let's get started. All right, so to start off with, you're gonna need to take all three of your uh, kind of grabber hook pieces, and you're gonna wanna stick them on sort of like this. So you see how that kind of works. All right, now after that, you're gonna wanna, you know, come over here, and you're gonna wanna take your, uh, this piece right here, and on the top, you're gonna wanna take, sorry about that, then you're gonna wanna take uh, your, uh, one of uh, these pieces right there, so one of your half triangle pieces, and then you're gonna wanna take one of these. And so you're gonna take your kind of triangle piece and put it right on top near the front of the hanger. And you're gonna wanna take the back and you're gonna wanna you know, latch it onto the bottom like that. So it's gonna end up looking like that. Now to do the other fin, you're gonna wanna take your other two and you're just going to want to make a pyramid because that's kind of how a, a fin tail looks. So the one farthest away from that little block will be facing away from it like that. And the one closest to it will be pointing to it. So when put together should make something like that. Then you're going to take this two latch side on the bottom, you're gonna flip this piece over and you're gonna stick it on the bottom. So that's the bottom of the tail. Then this one, you're just gonna stick right side up on the top and there's the top of your tail. So there you go. Now, putting all these pieces together, you're gonna wanna take the head for the front. Make sure the jaw is all the way closed and latch it on to the hanger. You see that? Now, you're gonna wanna go ahead and take the tail, put it on the back, like so. And there you have it. Oh, hold on. I'll put them up right like it was in the first little test movie. It was like that. So, there you go. That's how you build the Lego Atlantis set shark. I hope you've enjoyed this, and, and expect some more.